she fears us, okay? Now, if this were a live rabbit, if this were a real rabbit, she'd have both feet clamped onto the head, um, and I would go in, I would dispatch the rabbit quickly, so I'd take the, the, the neck in my gloved hand, quickly pull its legs so it doesn't suffer. Then I've got two choices. If I want to carry on hunting, I need to get her off of it without giving her too much food. So I do a trade. If we were finished for the day, I want her to associate catching rabbits with good news. I would open up, while she's on the head, I'd open up this stomach wall, pull it up, put my hand in, all the guts and everything go away, leaving the liver, the kidneys and the heart. And then I'd sit and help her eat it, maybe for 20 minutes until she's really full up of lovely, fresh, warm rabbit. Uh, and then I'll trade her off it, okay? So remember, I can't, if I go to take it off her, watch what she does, look. I don't want her to associate me with stealing from her because she will never hunt with me again. If she did hunt, and one day she'll catch a rat that she can carry. As I get close to her, she'll try and drag it away. So I need her to trust me. So you go in low and slow. Okay. Can you see her defending it? Offer her food. Now she's focused on that. I can cover up the rabbit. She's still attached. She's got one foot locked on. I've got to get her slowly to release that foot. Can you see that? Right, that's it. So now she's traded off. If she sees this rabbit now, it's not the same rabbit. It was only the same rabbit when she had continuous sight of it. Now it's just another rabbit. If I don't let her catch it, she might be cheesed off with me, but she won't know, won't think I've robbed her. And that fair exchange, which is no robbery, as we know, means that uh, now we could go on hunting. Well, I've given her a little bit more food than I would normally give her. We can carry on hunting and I can trade her off of as many as I need to. Uh, I don't normally multi-kill. Um, normally if she catches one, occasionally on the forest, when we're hunting on the forest, we have caught as many as five in a day with one bird. Um, but really, it's not about killing rabbits, it's about her having success. And it's worth also saying that um, every rabbit that... You can join us now, rabbit, you did very well. No, you wouldn't. You're absolutely right. No, it would have been more entertaining for us, though. And the whinging would have stopped. The whining would have stopped a lot quicker as well, I think. Um, the, the, one of the beauties, and not, not that I ever spend a lot of time defending hunting, because you're on a sticky wicket, really, but um, every rabbit she catches um, is ready to be caught. So maybe seven out of every ten rabbits will beat her, depending on the time of year. Um, a good rabbit that knows its territory will always do your bird if it's fit, as it should do, because it's a fair, fair test, if you like. So the rabbits that she's catching are the rabbits that natural selection has decided it's their time. But also, if she doesn't catch a rabbit, I still have to feed her one. You know, nothing, you know, she has to eat meat. So something has to die every day for her to survive. Same as that buzzard that we saw come over. The, the sheer fact it's there meant something died today. Mm. It's a fact of life. And I'd rather it was, um, I didn't abdicate responsibility for where the meat that she caught came from. Mm. I'd rather it was um, meat that I know is free range and organic and has every opportunity to, to get away. Um, the other thing is, uh, it is a true natural test between the two that has been going on for millennia. Uh, we don't help them in any way, shape or form. Um, in fact, I'd go as far as to say that we are more of a hindrance in terms of their hunting ability. Yeah, noisy footsteps. Yeah, noisy footsteps, wrong place at the wrong time. Um, getting her, you know, if she's hunting off the fist at uh, a uh, warren, you can bet your life you're standing in the wrong place. You know, the rabbit knows where you are. It'll come out the wrong hole. It'll come out when you're looking in the other direction. So it's very difficult, actually, to catch quarry. Um, but it is the most exciting thing um, to see them really turn on the afterburners. The difference between her flying to that lure and her flying to you was significant. Mm. And yet she knows that's a lure. Mm. You factor in a rabbit and the, the intensity is fantastic. You did very, very well, rabbit, okay? Despite all the whining, you did very, very well indeed. <laughs> Apart from the fact, I'm not sure you let go instantly. I didn't. I think you thought you were going to get further, didn't you, really? No. <laughs> I think Shall I give it to you to take back? I think can you rub, back? I think you rub the chicken nugget. Yes, you can. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll get halfway and then we'll transfer to you. Okay. Because she's a lot heavier than the bird you had. Okay? So I'm going to put her... The reason I've got you to roll your sleeve down is... You know I said they never bite you. She does. <laughs> she's, she's got a lot. She is just horrible. Look at her. See her lunging? That's it. 
Awesome. Fine. Well done.